you know, for, for us, this podcast is all about discovering new ideas, you know, ones yep. that can revolutionize this space, this industry. And it sounds like, you know, for, from my perspective, at least, Peter, you've done that. You created Reliability Extranet from this discovery that you made when you realized that there was a gap in the marketplace. Mm -hmm. I would love to learn more about what got you started with um, Reliability Extranet, figuring out what that gap was. So having been a reliability engineer on the ground and suffering the pain and frustration of being a reliability engineer, because it is, it's, it's quite a frustrating job. So there's a balance between data analysis and actually implementing. And in my humble experience, I find things go better when you spend more time on what I call habit five, facilitate to implement, actually working in, working with the people. That's where you make the difference. The first four habits are basically geared to give you the most time and for habit five. So the discovery is all about taking that frustration and reducing time spent, especially on habit four, okay? which is decide with data. We believe there is an intersection between artificial intelligence, the, in, the internet and communities. And we're talking about the reliability community. And what we're working on is, is something that the end goal is across the world that we only suffer the pain once. And those learnings are shared. Imagine a large car brand and how many cars say do I don't know, Toyota, Ford, General Motors make uh, a year, hundreds of thousands. And imagine that uh, something slipped through the cracks and there was a design flaw in one of those vehicles and that vehicle got to market, okay? This is where we come in as reliability engineers. We buy and people buy things and we're expected to engineer reliability through the life, life of that piece of equipment. Imagine if that happened in a country, say Brazil. I'm here in Australia and once it happens, and I've got that same model vehicle in my fleet of vehicles that I use for my business, I'm automatically notified about it. And the learnings about what has happened and how to deal with it are automatically transmitted. And that's what we're working on at Reliability Extranet. Okay. So Reliability Extranet is all about knowledge, tools, and data for mm -hmm. reliability engineers. Some of our inspirations for this thing is Netflix. It suggests movies that you like to watch. This thing that we're working on is going to suggest improvements. I don't know if you guys have heard of My Fitness Pal. So when you type a food into My Fitness Pal, what does it do? It tells you all the information about it. So what I, what I hear is it's really about sharing, spreading knowledge within the maintenance reliability community, taking that and ultimately enabling all of us to make smarter decisions around yeah, reliability of products, reliability of our equipment.